All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to take out the G35 so we can put it in the center of the garage so we can go ahead and change the oil. But I'm not sure if it's going to start. We actually might have to jump start it. So say hi to Cena right there. <laughs> Hey guys, it's Chris. Hey guys, it's your boy B Distinct. Welcome back to another video. Yes, guys, I did in fact get my first Tome product. But before I begin this video, I do want to announce one critical thing right now. The year's about to end. We got about like what, like five days left in the year of 2021. And I made a bet with you guys about six months ago that if we reach 30,000 subscribers by the end of 2021, I will give away my Halo taillights for free to one of you guys if we reach 30,000. We are about now like 1,300 subscribers away so we're a large ways but hey the internet hour the the internet is a powerful force so if you guys make it happen y'all get some free tail lights without further ado guys let's begin to this video if you guys don't know like the past couple of days we've been filming with our friend Joe and so first we we had a major scare that we had a get head gasket failure because my oil was like milky right apparently there's like this condensation thing that happens like I never knew that right so um, that's a first for me I got scared when I initially saw that but now my oil seems to be good after it burned off and that but we're gonna go ahead and do an oil change today to make sure that any of the oil at the bottom is still good right we want to make sure that it's not a head gasket problem if not we're gonna have to address it one way or another also if you guys see my g35 right now oh that's our friend cameron with the super but let's go show him. there's a wild super out here oh shit oh shit he's gonna back up will he scrape bro sideways bro sideways sideways bro don't scrape wait hold up hold up you good bro you good you clear. You good? Bro, you good. You good, bro. Oh, bro, give me one. <laughs> Yo, that's stock, boys. That's stock. Right, talking <laughs> about condensation, that's condensation right there, bro. Let's, that's not condensation. <laughs> Yo. Yo, it's not even through the outside. <laughs> that's not condensation, bro. That's Previously in the past, if you haven't checked out the other videos, I'm gonna post it right here. The link is also in the description. We fucking flew our hood off for the second time, yo. We're going for our third world record. Um, that's just, but no, jokes aside, we're, we're gonna fix that hood. Hopefully tomorrow, I'm gonna send it over to my friends and hopefully he can polish and restore the carbon. And then I'm gonna wrap it because I don't know how good it'll look. But um, regardless, I kind of like the color match, but I don't know. Different opinions. I posted a poll, I lost. All right, guys, we are now going to be releasing the oil from my car. If it's milky, bro, game over. This is my last video. If it's perfect, Perfect, <laughs> then we're good. We're good. Oh, you see how hard it was here? Why is it so hard? Fuck, dude, I'm so nervous, bro. For the video. Come on, baby. <laughs> That's for the next video. Are <laughs> oh, you ready? Yeah. Oh, snap. Three. Oh, fuck, bro. If this is why I'm gonna <laughs> fucking jump off a bridge. Ready? Three, two, one. Oh. It's oh. nice. Very Hold nice. Hold the magnet next to the CPM. Oh, yeah. Inside. Great success. All right, guys, so I just finished uh, putting the new oil filter. We tapped off the oil pan, and we just got to fill this bitch up with oil. It smells good. <laughs> All right, y'all ready? Right, this oil this. actually smells fucking nasty, though. You ready? Yeah, break my bumper, dog. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this oil, bro. Golden. You're wrong. You're supposed to spill it all over that. <laughs> Wait, is this the right oil? Here's no, something James, about James. James Charles getting canceled again because apparently he sent dick pics to this guy. And the guy doesn't want to erase him. Look, then why you sent him in the first place? Nasty. Especially being such a big celebrity. Why are you sending out dick pics, bro? I would never do that. Bro, how come you did that on my DMs? 
Hey, yo. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. This is my first homemade product that we're going to be installing in the G35. <laughs> bruh. Oh, bruh. This is bowling, bro, in person. The way that you displayed it, bro, you said nothing. You just said nothing. Bro, come, come look at Dude, the light, bro. absolute silence from the audience. It's shaped as a piston ring. As I mean, as a fucking piston. <laughs> Sorry, not ring. Take out the ring. Cheap ass. <laughs> it fits, bro. Oh, that shit glides nice. Just leave it like that. Um, you probably grab this and I grab the other end, right? I don't know how you guys are gonna work this out. Actually, hold up. This is just fucking piercing through. Give me a second. Yeah. Oh. Toothpick channel, bro. Ooh, that shit got good grip, bro. That's what I'm telling him, bro. That's what I was trying to say. Now pull that out slowly and leave that shit to dry. Or should I press it right now? No, no, no. no. <laughs> don't press it, bro. Just leave it. There are some scratches, but those are super deep. But compared to how the hood was before, it's looking mint. And like I said, guys, we're gonna go ahead and wrap the hood, give it a brand new look. I think it'll look awesome, but yeah. Thank you very much, like once again, bro. Came out good. Royal detailing, check them out. Links down in the description. Hood came out really, really nice. We got the Jeep back. It's raining a little bit, so I'm trying to get home as soon as possible. And also we have another issue, that same sensor which means something's wrong, either the freaking, there's some disconnection, like either the wire freaking ripped or or something, something's going on, but we gotta fix that issue um, and we'll fix it back at home. Uh, it shouldn't be anything too major. Hell yeah, dude. All right guys, so the G35 is officially home. <laughs> back to how it, kind of was but um yeah so let's talk about about the hood a little bit so you guys can see i don't know if you guys will see it on camera yeah you guys can you guys see that big scratch right there so it does have some scratches and that's just from like you're, you're not going to be able to take that off because that scratch just happens to be deep enough to like i'm pretty sure it cut through the clear coat and it's cutting through the resin right so in order to get rid of that you can but you'd have to sand down the whole hood make sure it's level to the level that it cut down to and once everything's flat i would still recommend putting another layer of resin to make sure you don't have such a thin layer of resin and then you'd have to clear coat the whole hood again and you can definitely do it but it's just going to be a lot more work a lot more time thank you to royal detailing it came out freaking superb really really good job and to right now uh one of my friends uh you guys might know him on instagram gtr underscore burnt rubber uh he has a green gtr right well he still has it and the freaking nut job and i mean that in the most positive way ever he freaking bought a twin turbo r8 from sheepy race man get that what the hell that's absolutely insane and so he's actually bringing it here close to my town in about like two hours so i want to go ahead check it out that's an insane build so i want to go ahead check it out see i don't know if we're going to take out the g because it is raining fire what fake taxi <laughs> hey let me get in the fake taxi bro <laughs> what's up bro got the fake taxi bro you better get one punk <laughs> Just fucking nice, bro. Oh, hell yeah, dude. I love it's just... it, dude. It's just fucking... Dude, the steering was like small and compact. Yeah, it's fucking yeah, yeah. sick. And you get the start button like right there. Yeah, fucking legit. Oh, cool. Yeah, it's Oh, nice. hell yeah, dude. Fucking nice. Congrats. 
How much is it pushing? Like eight hundred? Hand me that camera right there. Yeah, I got you. Yeah, so it pushes uh, eight hundred to the wheels. Jesus Christ! <laughs> eight hundred to the wheels, like Jenny. Oh my God, it's just so nice. It's like a fucking pilot. Why, bro? Why? Why, bro? Anyways, guys, that was pretty sick, bro. We got to see his freaking R8, bro, by Sheepy Rays, bro. That's freaking insane, bro. But anyways, guys, I think we ended up this video on a good note. Our oil was good. We changed it. Everything good. We got our new, brand new oil cap. Looks absolutely insane. Looks super good. The hood came out really good. Shout out to Royal Detailing once again, bro. That hood came out super good. And then we just got to wrap it. That's going to be for another video. But I'm really excited, bro. Everybody's getting new cars. And now I'm getting this new car fever where I need a new car. I know I asked you guys in the YouTube community. I'm torn between the Supra and the Z. I know a lot of you guys want to see the Z. And that's kind of where I'm leaning towards to. I think having the G35 and the Z and continue that Infinity Nissan family would be freaking sick. So I think it's coming out spring 2022. I have a friend who hopefully is gonna help me, the guy that bought the Audi R8. Hopefully he's gonna help me get an allocation for the Nissan Z. In 22, I don't know, was that March, May, April, around those freaking months. And we'll see the Z on the channel, bro. I'm super excited. And uh, yeah, we'll see you guys there.